Well, hello there. John Burley here. I want to talk to you guys today about shiny object syndrome. Do you know what it is? That's I got to get every single newest, greatest, latest thing. And every three to six months, basically shift entirely what I do so that I never, ever, ever get out of the rat race. Hey, look, shiny object syndrome. I get it. I beat it out of my system decades ago. Um, you know, in my adult life, I've owned a few companies and then I owned a brokerage business. And then I've owned a private equity company, real estate. I've been doing the private equity company since 1989. One of the things my students comment about, because the first audio program I did was back in 93, and it's an old one. It's just in the archives. It's on our Burley Black Card site for the, the high-end program. And they're like going, wow. And they listen to us like, John, the program you did in 93, the end game, is the exact same 30 years later. It never changed. Now, sure, how we buy, where we buy, what we pay, what the interest rates are, what the marketing is, what the acquisition, those all shift with technology and where we are in a market cycle, which is always changing, you know, and where we are. But I never shifted from what I did. Once I found what was for me, I did it great. And where did I learn that? From a book? From a seminar? No. I learned it from the street in the real world. See, I've been blessed in, in the private equity company, Real Estate, that we formed in 1989. And I literally was like the, one of the first guys, if not the first guy, out of a Wall Street background to go into single-family home private equity, meaning doing huge portfolios back when nobody did portfolios. And I did that right in the commercial because everybody knew that the cap rate's higher. I mean, single-family home, a mediocre investor in a mediocre town can get 8 to 10% right now, and that same town funds are fighting to buy commercial properties for 3 to 4%. And if you just go a little bit more rural or you get good at what you do, 15 to 25% is easy-peasy in today's world, even with prices and interest rates and rents right where they are if you know what you do in your trade. So I can get a 15 to 25 cap. Why would I go buy an office building for a 5 cap? I don't. We had to work out models and systems, but we did it. I have almost a 1,000 people that I've worked with placing their money, investing their money from them from both the brokerage and from the real estate side, the private equity that we do. Almost all of these clients were rich or wealthy. Wealthy meaning there's a lot of stuff that's going to the next generation. Rich meaning they got a lot of income. You know, I've had very, very few investors and people I work with who were not millionaires. Some from the very early days, friends and family, you got money for down payment on two or three houses. Sure, you're in because back then, you know, everybody qualified if you could sign for a loan and have the down payment money. Almost everybody. Today, that's very, very different. Been that way different for decades. Most of my clients are decade millionaires to century millionaires. They have 10 to $100 million in actual wealth. Way, way even more is I do have not quite 10 that are billionaires. Literally are worth billions of dollars. Let me help you out. Like 99% of them didn't do shiny object. Oh, when we were younger, all of us. When we were poor, all of us. And then we realized, hey, there is no magic wand. There is no miracle. There is no get rich quick buying this or this or that or that. There is no secret penny stock I can buy. None of that works. Not for long-term sustainable. We all treated our investment portfolio like a business. We all specialized, focused, learned, spent Tons and tons. I spent over a million dollars on education. I'm not talking about colleges and high schools and, and grade schools for me. I spent over a million dollars on my education, learning about psychology, learning about emotions, and learning about how to properly invest for decades and decades and decades. I got extraordinarily do good at what I do. And I literally have been doing the exact same real estate transaction on like 98% of my transactions are the exact same transaction in... A dozen states and a couple different countries. We're focused in Phoenix, but we've worked in a dozen states and a couple different countries. Thousands and thousands and thousands and thousands of properties. And at the end of the day, it's the same thing every time. Because we understood shiny object destroys you. You shift your attention. You think you're multitasking. You think this is going to be better. And you shift and you shift and you shift. And you're eternally chasing that magic wand that doesn't exist and never has and never will. So what I suggest, whatever your niche is, whatever you've chosen to do, get great at it and do it for the long, long term. And then let me help you out. 
the men and women I know who are very wealthy, they focused on longer term transactions, not short term. And they focused on in continually increasing the net cash flow, which was a combination of, first of all, obviously reducing expenses, paying off debt, and then increasing income streams. It's easier to reduce expenses than increase income. Everybody knows that. So the shiny object syndrome is to pick one thing and then shine it, shine it, shine it, shine it, shine it, and make it awesome. Hey, man, this is John Burley. Oh, cool shirt today. This is uh, from uh, last year. Uh, this is from the uh, John Burley Boot Camp. It was our 30th annual event. So we've actually had the longest running real estate training in the world. People come from all over the world to learn how to do it. And we go do it for real. Um, we do events every quarter and, and you can find out about them. So go to johnburley.com. I've got a whole bunch of free tools there for you. Downloads that you can get. And there's a whole bunch of information. So johnburley.com. Get your free downloads. Find out about future events. Here on YouTube. Look, like, comment subscribe and anything you want me to talk about just put it in here and i'll do it next thing you can do is hop over and join the conversation on facebook the john burley real estate group john burley real estate on facebook and you know what if you just like to get those quick connections and a lot of positivity go to instagram ig and do john dot burley so john dot burley on instagram john burley real estate on facebook here on YouTube, John Burley, C-O-M, John Burley Com, and JohnBurley.com to get to the website and get your free tools and downloads. Hey, I hope you love this. Stay away from shiny objects. Get one shiny object and polish it until it is bright and shiny for all of your life. Do the same thing over and over and over again and become extraordinary at it like every great investor and business owner who ever lived on the face of the earth. This is John Burley saying thank you. God bless. You guys take care. Thanks, man.